what's up everybody and welcome back to my vlog today i am going to do a fun little makeup tutorial for all of you some of you actually asked me to do this via dm and i was just waiting for one little thing to arrive before i did it and also because i have a really ugly friend over here that decided to stay for a few days when i wanted to shoot it was really bad like trust me so Today, I am going to do my Lisa um, How You Like That promo photo um, makeup tutorial. So without further ado, here we go. But of course, before we start, always remember to like, to comment, to subscribe, and to turn on those notifications so that you... Why do I keep pointing? Let's not point anymore, Patricia. Don't point. But anyways, turn on your notifications so that you know every time I post a new video. And always remember, all my social media um, accounts and all the links are down in the description box below. So you can find me on TikTok, on Facebook, on Instagram, and on Twitter as well. So without further ado, here you go, you guys. My makeup tutorial for Lisa's How You Like That promo photo look. All right, and for your reference, this is the photo that I'm going to be copying or the look from this photo that I'm going to be copying. And I also want to give a quick and uh, disclaimer. I don't know where this sound is coming from, but then there's someone that is um, doing a bit of construction on their house because that. So if some clips are not continuous, then you will understand it's because I have to cut sometimes or else that sound is just going to be bugging me the whole time. Anyways, here we go. First step for that look is I am going to lay the foundation on my face and then I'll get back to you. So to conceal any blemishes, I'm using this Benefit concealer and I'm going to just put it on spot areas because I don't really put on full-on concealer and then I will be blending it with a beauty blender and then after just to seal it in I'm going to be using this MAC and C35 powder to just lock everything into my face. And there you have it. Um, that is pretty much just the base of my makeup today. And then I'm going to be Actually, the look is fairly simple. So again, this is what it looks like. It's um, more dramatic around the eyes because she did feature her new haircut and this bold black color. So doesn't have much, but I'm going to make it happen. So let's do this. Brows and then blush. So my brows, I'm going to be using the Brow Definer in Soft Brown by Anastasia Beverly Hills, which is my favorite um brow pencil actually i still have my brows tattooed on but um i just want to make it a little bit more defined because i actually need to have it retouched soon because you have to have this retouched after a few months and it's been a good number of months so let's just get in there I'm just going to put some brow gel and move on to the next step. I actually used two Sunnies and Anastasia, but since um, the color is already pretty dark, I'm just going to go with this one. It's a clear brow gel. Okay, and for my blush, I'm going to be using this Hourglass um, Dim Infusion in Ambient. It's a light blush. Um, on my cheeks because again her blush is not that um, obvious it'll just give me a little bit of a glow all right and that's for my blush it's very very light um, like I said again it's going to get heavier on the eyes so that's what I will do now and luckily I just got my lashes retouched at new lounge I'm not going to talk about how the whole process went because my next vlog is going to show how um, it all happened. 
but yeah i got it retouched and i have a super curl in 11 and 14 it is crazy long but i super love it i miss my lashes and then after that it'll be a, a matte bold lip it'll be a matte bold lip and then the transformation will be pretty much complete okay so for the eyes it was a lot of um black which i don't normally use so you can tell by here it's noir by anastasia that is what i'm going to be using on the top lid of my eyes and then for the lower i actually have two kinds of eyeliners this one is from k palette um the eye pencil that lasts for 24 hours and this one i just got at a convenience store um from hong kong when i was there last and it's the sailor moon one i had to get it because it was sailor moon and then um after that i might probably try and contour my nose a little bit let's see how this goes i am no makeup artist i literally just learned how to do makeup on my own by myself so so let's start with the under eye first because that is what i'm more confident in so let's use let's use this first because this one has a sponge there and we'll see if this is if it writes okay Whoa, I have not worn this much eyeliner in ages. One eye done, now for this one. Yeah, that is dark enough. <laughs> Definitely dark enough. And since there are a little bit of gaps in my eyes, I'm going to fill it in Ooh, with this one. So there's a little bit of like orange and brown on her lid, so that's what I'm going to do. She has like this really cool like a uh, flick at the end of her eye, um, which is also blended out to be a little bit stronger. So I think I can go with just a little bit of a brown. From my um, two, uh, two Faced Sweet Peach palette, I'm going to go with the Puree, which is my favorite. And I'm going to add a little bit of Summer Yum, these two, and create this nice warm eyeshadow look. Okay, and I'm going to add a little bit of shimmer using um, caramel. Is it caramelized? Caramelized, and a little bit of cobbler as well. All right, I think that's looking good. Um, in terms of the eye makeup at the bottom, it's okay. So now I'm just going to add a quick wing tip. This one is from Miranese. I hope I sp I pronounced that right. This one. It actually has two tips. There's a thin and a thicker one. So I'm just going to, I'm not gonna draw the whole eye. Um, I'm going to do that with powder in a little bit, but then I'm just going to add the flick at the end with the smaller. So this is the thicker tip. And this is the smaller fine tip one. Eye number one. Now, next eye. Okay, so I contoured my nose while that whole thing was going on. I'm just going to highlight my nose now and then I'm going to put on my lipstick. This one is from Tom Ford. Um, this is the sheer cheek duo in paradise lust so i just use my finger to go through my nose like and 
yeah, before I forget, I'm going to do a little bit of the black liner on top of my eye. So this brush is from Sephora. And I want to show you a cool bit about it. It has my name on it. <laughs> it's just really cool. So I'm going to just put a little bit of black on the top part of my lid. Maybe it's not a good idea because I'm not too good at that. So let's just do this. Let's use a thick tip now. So this is what the thick one looks like. And then let's just add on to this. There you go. Okay, so based on the photo, her lips had this um, like peachy, orangey look. So I'm going to be mixing two lipsticks today. And first one is um, the Teviant and Anthea um, and Elizabeth and Milk Tea by Sunny's Face. So I'm going to start with this one because this is actually a little bit um, drier than the Milk Tea. So let's get to it. Followed by this. All right, so let me just finalize my look and then I will get back to you in three, no, three, two, one. So there you have it you guys, that was my Lisa's How You Like That um, teaser photo um, makeup tutorial or makeup transformation vlog and I hope you enjoyed it and if you do please remember to like, to comment, to subscribe and to hit the notification button so that you will know whenever I have new videos out and thank you so much for watching and till the next vlog, see you guys! <laughs>